first appearance at these championships. A special anniversary edition, in fact, games held across multiple nations. A true pan-European tournament that is a reflection of the pan-European nature of the game. And this is where it all starts for them. 11 players, many of them friends, some foes during the league season, now united for a single cause as they carry the hopes and expectations of a nation in this grand quadrennial event. Ahead of us, a month of non-stop adrenaline rush. I trust you are strapped in comfortably for what will be, at least for partisan parties, the most unbearable, thrilling of emotional roller coasters. One glance and you know where we are. It is one of the most recognisable arenas for the beautiful game in the world. And boy, does it add to the occasion. So it is upon us, their opening game, and what they hope will be the first of many fine games in this championship. All I hope is that these nations, as well as the players, of course, can make a good account of themselves. And I also like the fact that such excitement isn't just something that one host country has the monopoly of. It's shared by so many people across the continent, literally, and that certainly created a, an extra special buzz. Well, if you did just miss it, we are up and running already. Who do you think this turns on, Jim? Yeah, Timo Werner. He's quick and direct, Peter. Loves to play on the shoulder of the last defender, and he's always looking to make that run in behind. I think having someone like that up front makes the opposition defences think twice about playing such a high line and pushing them. Real chance! a fine save well that was high class goalkeeping there to back up his, his high class wage gets his head to it and oh he's got that completely wrong but no less drives it forward Germany have begun the game in high-octane fashion. Yeah, it's a good start, Peter, and they look hungry for goals, and they'll be aware of having to capitalise in such a good spell. And it's Sané. Sané. Knocks it away. be a throw in Kimmich defenders on the back foot good ball oh good ball it's a good run that great timing Gnabry looking to get on the end of this. Gnabry. And a header! <laughs> Kroos. Forward tracking back like that, always appreciated by the crowd. Well, they say that your front lads should be that first line of, um, of stopping the opposition, and I think he's taken it to another level with his desire to get back and, and help everyone out. Sané pumps it into the area. He's there to get rid. Referee's given a throw. Aimed in towards the centre. Cleared away. Hits one! Away from immediate danger. And out to safety. Safety. 
Sane goes for the cross. Oh, that's not going to find its target. And it's Gnabry. And the finish! Oh, and the follow-up! Good try. The outcome could so easily have been different. A more than decent attempt, Peter. Straight out wide. There's no flag. Oh, that's a fine challenge. It's a very good battle there. Terrific to watch. Werner. He's in space and looking for options. Can Gnabry! Oh, he did the hard part right, but fluffed the finish. It didn't quite come off on this occasion, but it only needs a gentle tweak. And it's been taken straight back. Drives it towards the front. And that's a goal kick. Good running with the ball, can they build on it? Werner! And that'll go straight through to the keeper. Is that a foul? Yes, the uh, referee's given it. Good challenge, he just stood firm. Yeah, that's top defending and preventing him turning, which can open up many possibilities. And it's played forward. Plays it out to the wing. Well, he acknowledges that he should have come up with something better there. Yeah, I mean, he, I think he did well to, to spot the run. He just didn't get enough behind it. It happens. And it's Sané. Not much subtlety, he's launched himself there. Danger averted for now. Sané. It's Werner! Just off target. Werner clearly became one-eyed then. He just decided to force it. Gnabry. Oh, he's going to be pulled back for that one. And it's Canabry. Adventurous run from a defender. And Lola is there, and he can get that clear. Out of play for a goal kick. Out to the left it goes. Great strength, too strong for his opponent. Well, Tunis. Manolas sends it forward. Gnabry. And he 
subtly caught him there, it's a free kick. Well, it was deliberate, it was cynical, and you have to understand the frustration of, of being denied a clear opportunity, but it had to be done. So the last big chance perhaps before half-time. And the potential here for the first goal of the game. Decent enough try. Tony Crows did give it a fair old crack, and he'll be encouraged to step up again. And we hit half-time. So both sides have drawn blanks. They have twirled at times, but it's not been a bad game by any means. And we are up to the break. What an end to the half, Peter. Uh, a lot of the best action of the half coming at, at the very end. And I get the feeling the second half may well start in, in similar fashion, as we'd love to see this momentum maintained. So I'm looking forward to what's to come. After 45 minutes, it is still goalless. A change, perhaps, after half-time. So we're just settling back into this second half. Germany playing well with lots of opportunities and plenty positives to take from the first half despite this scoreline converting chances would make a world of difference for them it's come loose that'll be a corner Stitch defending, but that'll do. He's got it, and he's goes for goal! And that's off target. Chan played out to the right. Goretzka. And here's Sané. Werner. And it's Chan. And here's Canabri. That's a bad place to challenge. What's he giving? So a big, big chance now from 12 yards. To get them off and running. Saved it. Good feeling they've missed the penalty, but they have to find a guttiness themselves from here. And here's Chan cleared without complication, battles to win it back. Well, that's where he wants it. Rubiger Henriks. Sane, he's on a run down the left wing. Knocks it away. That'll be a throw. Goretzka. Tries to get it forward quickly. It's being played forward. Gnabry. And here's Sané. Who's ball? Who's going to get there? Zena! And the ball's come out. Yeah, just thinking about the goalkeeper again. He really had to be at his best, didn't he? Rudiger. With a definite foul there. Chance! It's a goal! The breakthrough arrives at last! And that is about as cool as they come. He picked his spot expertly. Now that's what I call finishing, right in the corner. He knew instinctively who was where and didn't need to waste any time weighing things up. That's a cracking goal. Greece break the deadlock. 
The perfect display and the old saying comes to mind when the going gets tough, etc. And here's Sonny has a goal! In it goes! They have come roaring back! I can give the keeper a little sympathy here because I think he might have been slightly unsighted. However, credit where it's due, it's still a fine finish from a tight spot. Germany grab the equaliser and we're all square. Oh, I think the coach will really be annoyed with that. The players were still thinking about their goal and just got caught napping. Forward it goes. Siovas. Has he picked him out? Now can he finish? And he's onside. Hoists it forward. Or oh, Tunis. Henriks gets it back. Look at the defender bombing forward. Defending of the desperate variety. Gets it back. Well, that looks a foul. Yep, referee's given it. He's gone for the shots. Oh, how good is he? Sumptuous finish, an absolute joy. And they get themselves in front. Dispatched expertly, nicely done. Well, this is what we've been waiting for. And it's played forward. Foot in. Who's loose? Who's getting there? Gnabry. Gnabry tries making a foray down the right. Made into space out wide. Brandt has a point! Look at it! It's level again! What a match we have! Speed of thought, efficiency of movement, and certainty of outcome. Well, he made it obvious as to where the pass should be played, Peter, and it made the finish look that bit easier. So all square and not for the first time. Well, there's resilience for you, Peter. As a side, they never lost focus despite the setback. And this is thoroughly merited for me. Now they can go on better, possibly. Look, this can still go either way. It might be flowing one way, but there's still time for some ebb. They didn't manage to get nearly enough into the box, and that speaks of little ambition. Well, it's a crossing feast here, but I'd advise them to keep a variety in their play to avoid being found out and stopped. Yeah, nobody's going to argue with that. Whistle's gone, that's a foul. save Schuller tries to clear tries a shot and somehow he managed to miss it you get the feeling that whoever scores the next goal here will be the winners of this type they can't afford to waste chances like that though Concentration levels are very good, and so is the commitment. This game could yet yield a winner. Plays it out to the flank. Looks to clip it forward. Greece showing a good level of intensity at this stage. They're calling on all their resources now. 
Now it's Sane. Chan. And it's Sane. Well, both sides might have to settle for a draw here, although there's still a chance for one last fling. Henricks. Sane looking to run onto it. Shapes to shoot! Just sails past the upright. Oh, and it's such a good effort. Maybe the target really should have been hit. Floats one over. Pass needed to be better than that, and he knows it. You wonder if that's it now, but there may be one more opportunity, Peter, for a late, late steal here. Ninety minutes up, we're into stoppage time. Now it's Canabri. Just brushed off the ball there. Yeah, he's fouled him there. Goretzka. Confirmation that there will be four minutes stoppage time. Oh, he's managed to get himself offside. Keeper's got good distance on that. Or Tunis. That's a decent ball. And he heaves it forward. And they've got it back as soon as they gave it away. And that will be the final.